Oh, that's good. Let's save. And let's make camp. And let's see if we can heal wounds on Applejack. No. Alright, never mind. Never mind. We can always bomb. Alright, what is what's going on here? This is a big room. The auto map is so bad. The auto map doesn't show you anything. So there's a room here, there's a kind of a light back there. Wait, what? A pouch? And a whole bunch of swords. Well, Twilight can hold everything. One of these might actually be magic. Uh, yeah, one of these might be magic. Oh, wait, she's full of stuff. Okay, let's move this to Applejack. And let's move this stuff to Rarity, because... Wow. That's, uh, that's a lot of herbs. I think one of these swords are actually magic. How do you... There's a pouch. Huh, strange. Where are the swords? The swords are here. What I want to try and do is... Just quickly save the game. And then... Cast the spell Twilight, Farsight, Breath of Magic. Breath of... Breath of Magic. Never mind, none of those are magic. Load the game. So we need to spread out these swords. Let me just give them to our new friend. Hopefully she does not run away with them. What's her... Okay, she's got five movement. Alright, that's fine. Save that. I don't know what's in the pouch, though. It doesn't give you the option to open the pouch. Actually, Pinkie Pie should be leading, right? So we just picked up a whole bunch of stuff off the... Nothing to be had. Oh, I see. It's this thing. The pile of loot is inside that thing. What is over here? Alright, that's not a secret door. There's some spikes on the ground. You can't see anything, can you, in the video? I can barely see anything in here. It's just really dark, basically. Um, fireplace. Is this like a, a castle? I don't know what this is. That doesn't lead anywhere. Just walk around a little bit. A barred trap door is let into the floor at your feet. Do you want to? Uh, you see a surreal light on the other side of the rubble, so there must be a way on the other side. But the rubble will not budge. Do you want to use an item? Uh, okay. Use an item. Use the uh, use the pouch. I don't know what's in the pouch. We used the pouch, and the wall s moved aside for us. I don't know what was in the pouch. But, you know, that makes sense. Role-playing game logic? We used the pouch to open a wall. The game does not say what's inside the pouch. As you enter the room, you think you see a flickering in the corner, as though something bright had just dissipated. Again, you hear that gruesome laughter, and this time, it sounds triumphant. Well, I just killed a bunch of your orcs the last time you laughed, so... Laugh it up, bro. Laugh it up. We'll see who gets out of this one. Uh, okay, we've gone to the first level already. Cool. What on earth is that? Is that a, a hole in the ground? That's a giant hole in the ground. There's water there. Can you guys see anything at all? Wait a minute. You can't cross? Oh! Ah! Magical invisible walkways. 
and to battle. Who are we battling? A sorcerer and an orc. Well, we need to probably need to shut down the sorcerer quickly. How should we go about this? Applejack, move forward. Do you think he has good magic defense? Let's try Fulminictus. Well, he's not good enough to block the Fulminictus, that's for sure. Let's move there. Can I do Fulminictus from this distance? No, no I can't. Alright, let's keep moving forward. And Twilight, can you do Fulminictus from this distance? What about the Fireball? Uh, apparently yes, five dice of damage. Ha! <laughs> huh. Well, there goes the sorcerer. <laughs> Laugh it up, bro. Laugh it up. We'll see who gets the last laugh. Not you, but you're dead. All right, let's surround this guy, and then hopefully none of his friends comes to find us. The last combat was kind of annoying because more and more orcs just kept appearing. Hopefully no more orcs appear. Alright, shoot the guy in the back, that's awesome. Let's just punch this guy until he dies. I think maybe if you like kill all the enemies before the, the reinforcements are scripted to arrive, that they just don't arrive. So like if there's a if it, there's a combat where it's scripted that after like three turns more enemies appear. If you kill all the enemies in two turns, then the battle just ends. And you don't have to deal with them. Although if you do that, you also get less experience from the combat, right? Because you, you kill fewer enemies. So it's not entirely sure that that's a good thing. Although if you're struggling, then maybe it's a good thing to kill them early. We are victorious. Ah, uh, oh look, it's a chainmail shirt. Let's see if Rainbow Dash can wear that. And what on earth is this? A Kun Chong. It's a it's a different kind of sword. Is it magic? I don't know. So how does so attack minus 2, parry minus 2. This thing is 6 to 11, 0, 0. But the Kun Chom is 6 to 11, 0, 0. So it's not actually any different. The Kun Chom. It's slightly lighter though. Can I put this on? Yes. Can I give this to somebody else? Alright, so now Rainbow Dash is a slightly better tank. And I don't know if any of this stuff is magical. Cool. Loot. Yeah, laugh it up. I'm getting the loot, so I don't know what, what you got, you're, you're laughing about. I'm killing your guys. Taking your stuff. Uh, so that's glowing. You leave the ruins labyrinthine corridors and continue on your way. Um, Rainbow Dash refuses to go any further. Do you want to cast me my friend and steal your companion with courage? Leave your companion behind her. Instill your companions with courage. Rarity manages to calm their companions and you dare to step into the emptiness. Ah, I see. The figure of a young elf manifests before you. She looks at you sadly, but then she smiles and you are filled with a new hope. Do not lose courage, my friends. You can achieve your aims if you are persistent enough. Then she vanishes leaving a small vial on the floor. Okay, what is this? One Courage Elixir, or I think that's what it is. So, Positive Effect Inspired, what does that do? Increases Courage by 5 points, I see. So this is like an Acrophobia test. So there's like invisible bridges, and if your characters have a fear of heights, then you have to... Um, roll dice or stuff to, to get through, which is fine. It's really dark in here. Okay, apparently we don't go that way. Go this way. It's really... Uh, take the vial. 
Alright, more courage elixirs. It's kind of cheating, but okay. Or rather, it's like we don't really need it. I don't remember this being in the original version of the game. Or perhaps it was, and it just wasn't. You leave the ruins labyrinthine corridors no. and continue on your way. Instill your companions with courage. Okay, rarity manages to calm the companions. And you keep walking over the emptiness. I don't understand why you have to do that. Although, every time you walk past it, the bridge appears. So I guess what you can do is leave them behind, walk forward a few steps for the bridge to appear, and then just go back to get them again once the bridge has appeared. That might make sense, right? Because you don't have to stay... You don't all have to do it at once. Uh, apparently that's not a thing. Unless this is a thing. Is this is a thing. What is what is this thing? This is a dead end. Oh look, it's a maze. A, a dark maze. Like you think you can't see anything? I can't see anything either. Like this is just black. And we have a light. We're supposed to have a light. I can't see a thing. Welcome to black screen the game. This is just bad. <laughs> this is, this is <laughs> can't see anything. It's not not good. Where am I going? I don't know where I'm going. Ah, uh, let's let's come this way. I don't I don't I don't, I don't, know, I don't know what's going on. Because Twilight Staff has light. What if I put her in front? Nope, no difference. Oh, wait a minute. Twilight and Fluttershy can level up. Yes, let's save the game. Make sure we don't mess this up. Alright. Let's level up. Fluttershy, level up. No. Uh, more vitality. More strength. Less acrofo. We know in this. She's only got three. Less. Less superstition. Nope, failed. More skill improvements. Combat. Piercing weapons. And then talents. What does she need? She needs plant law. How much? Oh, 11 plant law, that's good. Survival. And orientation. And treat wounds. Treat disease. Treat poison. Good. Two spells. What can she? What what kind of spells does she want? I think stuff like Master of Animals has been useful. Although we don't fight that many animals, but when we've needed it, it's been useful. Summon spirits. That's always entertaining to summon a uh, a friendly ghost. I guess great confusion and evil eye. Just stuff that disables the enemy. I guess more lightning. Anything that stops the enemy from attacking us is good. Um, that's about all we need, isn't it? Uh, light, sure. And then Twilight, level up. No, I want more vitality, more strength. Less necrophobia. No, failed. Why? I don't know. Do you want to turn 10 spell increases into more astral energy? Yes. More skill improvements. Combat spears. And then talents. What should we do with you and your talents? Maybe we should just get more treat wounds and treat disease, just in case of emergencies. Um, hiding, sneaking, and I guess maybe more alchemy, just in case. Don't think we need much more 
of this other stuff. Um, arcane law, nope. And then magic. More fireballs. More thorminictus, if you can. More be my friend. And uh, more summon skeletons. More heal poison. More balm. What else? More analytica. Just stuff that we're going to use. You don't actually use everything in the game. Some of the stuff is completely pointless. More put people to sleep. And more breath of magic. Sure. Alright, good. Done. Save the game, more level ups, hopefully we do even better in combat. Although we might be doing well enough, we might just want to go with defense next. What is this? That's not a thing. I think we want to try and go this way now. What is a... Uh, wait a minute. What's going on here? I don't even know what is going on. Haven't I been here before? Let's see the map. Wait a minute. The stairs is at that corner. Did I just walk past it before? How do I get over there? So this is the path here. The stairs are... Wait a minute, they're right here. Are you kidding me? Oh, look! Invisible stairs. It tells you when you get to it, but otherwise, you don't know where it is. 